The ninth generation Camry launched in China has three exterior styles, one more than in North America. Generally speaking, one of them is quite consistent in appearance with the North American version, while the second builds on the first, making it more detailed by adding chrome decoration to the front and rear lips, side skirts and other parts. The third model is a series of more electric shapes released in response to the wave of electrification in the Chinese market. The front fascia design is simpler and the shape of the grille is clearly different from the other two models. In comparison, this model has a more restrained temperament and a more businesslike appearance. However, it cannot be denied that the overall design style of the ninth generation Camry is sportier. In terms of details, the front of the ninth generation Camry has changed significantly. The Toyota logo changed from a vertical logo to a horizontal logo. The front edge of the hood has moved backwards. The entire front of the car was moved to the bodywork. In a fast stance and the C-shaped headlights are more aggressive. Black decorative panels on both sides of the bumper are matched with a black grille, black rearview mirrors and black roof. Many black details have been added to the appearance of the new car. The tail also uses C-shaped headlights to mirror the front and rear, but the entire tail design is still simpler. Interior, noticeably different from North American models. The interior design of the ninth generation Camry introduced in China is quite different from the previous models introduced in North America, losing its rough and harsh feel and becoming more simple and elegant. It can be seen that the central control part still has an asymmetrical design, but this is not so obvious anymore. The climate control area and the ambient lighting panel on the instrument panel are integrated in one piece and are made of leather-like materials that are very delicate and smooth to the touch. All real-life models are equipped with a 12.3-inch LCD instrument panel and a floating central control screen, but it is estimated that this large-sized screen may not be standard for all series. Since the design of the entire central control functional area of the new car is relatively close to the conventional models we are familiar with and other models from GAC Toyota, it will not be difficult to get started. When the vehicle is started, the interior takes on a different atmosphere. Breathing 63 color ambient lights can move according to the rhythm of the music. Ambient lights are also reflected in the door panels, but the colors will be slightly darker. In addition, the new car will feature various scents and will be accompanied by different music while switching between different scents. This system includes voice assistant etc. supports. It has in-depth cooperation with Huawei, including Huawei, and uses the 8155 chip to improve hardware performance, so the experience of the whole system is good. The voice assistant can support multiple commands and multiple domain recognition, and can also issue commands continuously after waking up. The tool still uses the Android system, but the user interface design is more simplified, much simpler and more intuitive to use. The new car is also equipped with wireless charging, built-in ETC and other functions, and the Nano Nano water ionizer has been upgraded to Nano X. This debut didn't reveal much about the power system. What is currently known is that the ninth generation Camry will be fully hybrid, the 2.5L model will no longer have a fuel-powered version, while the 2.0L model will add a hybrid version. In other words, in the future, the Camry will have three power systems to choose from, 2.0L fuel, 2.0L hybrid, and 2.5L hybrid. The hybrid system uses the fifth-generation smart electric hybrid engine. 